Hello everybody, this is Draco back for a Dinosaur King Battle Royale, I promised it, so here it is. We are in the Epic Arena, as you can see, and I have fenced off the uh, aquatic bit because we don't need it, because we don't have any aquatic. I'm sure you may be noticing a few changes, and you'll see why those changes have been made in a minute. But yes, we have 40 beautiful species for me for me to release and duke it out. I believe this will be the biggest Dinosaur King only Battle Royale I've done so far because I haven't done 40 species. And the interesting thing about this one is that I will not be including Indominus Rex and Indoraptor this time because I feel like they might be a bit too powerful for these guys. And you know, some we don't want to see them two win, do we? We want to see a Dinosaur King Dinosaur win. Of course, on the other opposite side, the sauropods in this like, uh, well, like Joboria, well, nothing can take it on, so Joboria will just be there, basically. <laughs> oh, it's not easy. Maybe, maybe I'll make, maybe I'll make a hybrid that can kill sauropods. I think maybe that could be, that could be next. Of course, I, I don't plan to do a hybrid for a long time yet, so you'll just have to wait and see. Right, anyway, let's, let's not mess about, let's not mess, mess about, let's just release everything. So, let's start with Aloetrox. <laughs> Um, okay, yeah, the first thing you can see is that I've actually fixed the fairy. I've removed the feathers that were on here and on the tail, and I've actually given it its distinctive head crest. And yes, this was quite hard to do because, obviously, as I mentioned in the showcase video, every time I edited this model, the game crashes. So what I had to do is actually use a save file, send it to somebody else, and have them to export the export the file that I sent into the OVL file to send back to me and that worked. So yes, a big shout out to Dino Nerd for helping me out with it. Very appreciated. And yes, I finally, we finally have the fairy fixed. Not that there was anything wrong with the other model, but you know, we want a Dinosaur King fairy, don't we? And the Dinosaur King fairy looks like that. So yes, we have some returning legends here. We have the Papasaurus fresh from the showcase. Okay, yes. Well, I, I'm sure as you can see the Spinosaurus is new. Well, it's new and not new because I already made a Spinosaurus, but obviously I lost all my mods and Spino was one of them. So yeah, my main focus at the minute is remaking all the mods that I lost before. And obviously Spino is one of them. We also have the return of the OG Triceratops. I also improved the uh, crest a bit in comparison to the last one where the green was a little bit too vibrant. So it's a lot darker, well duller I should say. Makes it look nicer. Yes, we have Ulti Rhinus here, Mega Fagnax. Okay, this one isn't actually mine. This one is um, Lambiosaurus Magna Crustatus. And this was made by Toka Nightmare. And they actually sent me this so I can make it into a new species. And <laughs> I've had a couple of attempts making it into a new species using stuff like Ubu Titan as prefab and such. But I failed miserably. So, and I've pretty much forgot about it since. So yeah, hopefully I can get it into a new species one day. Oh, we have the Kakirodontosaurus. The living legend here, Patasaurus returning fresh from the showcase. Yes, the Carnotaurus is back as well. Actually, this one might be a modded Carnotaurus model because I don't remember it looking chunky. It might be the Fallen Kingdom car. We have Ceratosaurus as well. Another returning legend. Allosaurus Atrox over there looking pretty good. Oh, we have the Invincible Joe Borrier because we don't have Indominus Rex, so nothing will be able to kill it. Actually, maybe we could have like a competition, like which sauropod survives the longest. But we have, well, not Draco Rex, if I can click on it. Not, well, it's not Draco Rex, it's Fukuisaurus, but again, I haven't been able to make it into a new species because I haven't found a prefab that works. Yes, Megalosaurus back in the action again. The Epistocela Claudia, again, haven't hadn't made it into a new species yet because, well, I tried making it using the Pseudoceratops as a prefab and it kind of um, didn't work. Yes, Pentaceratops is back in the action. Five-horned beast. Got Polacanthus there looking pretty good. 
Macrosaurus having a snoozer. Okay, anything else I need to go through now before we start? I don't think there is. I'm sure many of you have, no I'm sure you've all noticed by now that there's a bit of snow on the trees here. And that's because, I, I may have lied, we don't have 41 combatants duking it out. We're gonna have 41. And let's release dino number 41. <laughs> Cychania, will you please move? Yes, someone turned up the AC here because we have a Kralophosaurus entering the fray. This beautiful model was made by Dino Nerd and the skin was made by moi. Um, it's, it's still a work in progress. Well, the only thing I actually need to fix is the crest and I don't really know how to fix it because the texturing on the crest is a little bit weird. Oh, oh well, the park tour's dead. But yeah, we have a crawler for source and oh, actually I need to fix the back spikes as well. They're supposed to be the darker blue, but yeah, we have Kralophosaurus entering the fray. Alright, that's enough jibber jabber, let's get on with it. Alright, so who do you think's gonna win this one? I I don't know, I think the fairy I think the fairy might have a good chance because I believe the fairy is actually really powerful and his stats are almost on par with Indominus Rex, so the fairy might have a good chance. Uh, I suspect Megafaganax and the Stegojira should do well because I gave them good stats. Well, Megafaganax in particular. The Sychenia could be one to watch because, again, I gave it awesome stats. Okay, here we go. We got our first fight, and it's a Carnotaurus taking on a Megaraptor. Ooh, we got Mapusaurus over there against Eocarcaria. Now, Eocarcaria seems to do well in these battles, so don't be surprised to see Eocarcaria go all the way. Mm. Oh my god, the Megaraptor not looking good at all. Yeah, it should get two hits off. I made Megaraptor quite beastly. Okay, I think that's it for them too. They're going to stand down. Mac oh, Eocarcaria taking a beat in early on. And Lillian Sternus taking on the Deinonychus. Now, Lillian Sternus is, that, is actually one of the better mini dinosaurs in this. So, could be one to watch. Oh, hang on, never mind. Oh, it's Kralophosaurus against Ultirhinus. Come on, Cryo. Do something special. You know, I went to all the effort of making you just for this video. Oh, the ulti Rhinus is gone, and the Fukui Raptor taking on Gojurasaurus over there? But we don't care about that. We want to see Kralophosaurus. Yeah, yeah, you're a bit late to tell me, because they've been fighting for about five minutes. What's our dead over there? Oh, no, the para died. Ooh, got its neck snapped by Stegojira. Oh, hang on, never mind. We got the fairy taking on the Spino. Oh, the fairy taking a hit there, but the Spino taking a bigger one. Come on, Therosinosaurus. Kill it! Like, Therosinosaurus is the best hope for the herbivores. It is an absolute beast. Although, it does fight other herbivores, so... You know, it's kind of a wild card. So the fairy... Could be one to watch. What's that dead over there? Oh, oh no, the Fukuisaurus killed by its price. S, S, SPH. I think that's Sorofaganax. And wow, the fairy would have lost. What are your stats? Oh, the neck is a bit weird there. 103 to 32, so that's 135. Oh yeah, oh yeah, the Spino's actually better. Yeah, no surprise the Spino one. Okay, seems to be a bit of a lull. Fukui Raptor died. Another Titan's gone. Shunosaurus is gone. Oop, Gorgosaurus taking on Ankylosaurus. Whoa, Gorgosaurus taking a hit. But, yep, yeah, Ankylosaurus is gone. Gorgosaurus showing no mercy there. Hunting like a pack of single gorgosaurus -ness. Beep, beep. Look, there's a busy body in the way. You'll just have to wait. And there's a destroyed vehicle as well. Oh no, Poposaurus died, killed by Megalosaurus. Oh no, I would like to have seen that. Ooh, Carnotaurus landing a hit on Megafaganax. Ooh, Megafaganax not in the best of shapes. Megaraptor taking on the T-Rex over there. But the Carnotaurus is gone because there's no match for the power of this beast. Megafaganax probably one of the favorites to win this whole thing. And you can see why, as it overpowers the Karn. Oh, Ceratosaurus against Macrosaurus. Oh no, Megaraptor's gone! Oh, Megaraptor always sucks in these tournaments, in these matches. Well, battles, I should say. 
Makusaurus making quick work of the Serato there. Ooh, Makusaurus. Could Makusaurus be one to watch? Ooh, we got a Clash of the Magma Blasters. Oh, hang on. No, no, no. This is more important. We have two secrets going at it. The Megalosaurus taking on the Cryo. Ooh, which one of these two beasts will win? Will it be Megalosaurus or will it be the Cryo? Wow, Cryo has a really long tail. I shrunk the tail on the Megalosaurus. That's why it looks slightly shorter. But wow, Cryolophosaurus has a very long tail. It's like a sneak. Ooh, Megalosaurus getting a hit. Is the Cryo done? Oh, oh, well, that car's certainly done. Yeah, Cryo, Cryo would have lost that. Interesting. Oh, well, Sorofagnac's having a bit of fun there with the cars. Oh, Eocarcaria's dead. The Triceratops killing Eocarcaria there. Boah, right through the neck. Ah, oh, wish this was Chomp, because we could have had a electric charge moment then. But, oh, well. Right, there was a fight between the Ferry and the Spino I want to see. Spire, I think. Ooh, which one of these two clawed beasts is going to win? Um, I don't know who, it, who would win in real life between a Ferry and a Spino. I'd probably say the Ferry. I feel like the Ferry would actually win against a Spino. But I don't know, maybe Spino would have a better chance. Oh, I think the Ferry's going to die. Oh, I'd, be dis I'd be disappointed if the Ferry died. Stegodura against Nodosaurus. I think, yeah, Nodosaurus, I think, is going to die here. <laughs> Ain't no match for this bone-crunching beast. Sorofagonax just wants to kill cars, apparently. That's all it wants to do. It doesn't want to fight, it just wants to fight cars. Blech. Ooh, a classic clash here between the Allosaurus, Atrox, and the Stegosaurus. Ooh, which one of these two will win? Oh, the Atrox is backing down. Interesting. Ooh, we got a fight between T-Rex and Mega Faganax over here. Mega Faganax. Ooh, I think Mega Faganax is done here. I think the T-Rex is actually going to win. Go on, T-Rex. Can you finish him off? Do something. Yep, that's Mega Faganax done. Wow. Big surprise here, Mega Faganax gone. Well, if you betted on Mega Faganax winning this, you're wrong because it's dead. Ah, there we go. We can watch Torvosaurus take on Megalosaurus over there and Pentaceratops. Wait, is Pentaceratops going to win? Oh, the Sorofaganax is gone. Oh, another kill for the herbivores. The Pentaceratops finishing off the Sorofaganax. Oh, right through the eye socket, in the brain, insta-kill, Pentaceratops looking good. Who, who won this fight? Wait, was it, did the Torvosaurus die or something? No. Okay, who we got here? Oh, the Ferry is healing up a bit, I think. Are these... Oh, these two gonna... Fi oh, oh my god, the Ferry! <laughs> Calm down, buddy, you're only having a fight. Oh, I think this is the it, it for the Ferry, but I tell you what, it gets the first hit. Oh, fairy, can you do it? God, I just want to see the fairy get one kill. It's not going to get a kill, is it? The Spino's too powerful. Oh, it's backing down again. <laughs> These two seem to just want to fight each other, which is interesting. Wait, what? Oh my goodness. The Cocheridontosaurus killed by Triceratops. Don't mess with this guy. He killed, he killed his cousin and he killed him, the Kaka. Ooh, now this could be an interesting fight because, again, Cychania is one of the more powerful herbivores in this. Although, the Macrosaurus has given it quite a beating by the looks of it, so it might be the end for Cychania here. Oh, Torbosaurus going down over there against the Gorgosaurus. Gorgosaurus looking pretty good. Is that it for the Macrosaurus? Nope. But I think they might stop. Yeah, they're going to stop. Cychania looking mightily impressive there as Megalosaurus has some fun with the cars. Oh no, never mind, that wasn't Torbosaurus, that was Allosaurus Atrox going down. Okay, so who do we have left? Okay, Serato dead, Megaraptor dead, Carno dead over there. Opistacy Lacordia just enjoying life. Okay, let's get rid of some of these dead bodies. Oh, Lillian, wait, Lillian Sternus died? Gojurasaurus is gone, I think. 
No, Deinonychus died to Gojirasaurus, and Lilien Slunus died to Deinonychus. Oh, I wish, I wish I saw that. Actually, would you like to see a mini battle royal between the little guys? Because we don't see them that often. <laughs> Look at Gojirasaurus taking on the T-Rex. Ooh, now this could be interesting. Uh, we'll watch this as well. Ooh, the Spino actually taking on Megalosaurus. Wait, is Megalosaurus going to win? Okay, well, Stegojira killed Pentaceratops. No surprise there. Wait, where's the fairy fight? I want to see the fairy fight. Oh, it's down there. We could watch both secret... Oh, the Spino's gone! The Spino's biting the dust against Megalosaurus. Wow, Spinosaurus was holding his own against the fairy, but Megalosaurus finishes it off. Ooh, teamwork by the secret dinosaurs there. Oh no, the fairy's gone! Oh no, the Torvosaurus killed it! No! Ferrazinosaurus is dead. Nam! Ooh, this could be an interesting fight actually. Polacanthus is on 100% and the T-Rex is not. The T-Rex might get hit. Oh, it does get hit. God, Polacanthus, you can do it. You go on, you can do it. Cychania, not looking in the best of shapes, but it is on the recovery. Oh, hang on, I actually want to see this, because... No way. No way, the Triceratops! No way! Oh my god! The Triceratops is a killing machine! It's killed the Gorgosaurus! Oh my goodness! The Triceratops is, is hungry, apparently. But it's not stopping it from killing everything. It's, it's killed three dinosaurs. Bloody hell, that's insane. Ooh, hang on. We might have a kill for Kentrosaurus here. Taking on the Mahusaurus. Mahusaurus seems to always suck in these. Oh, he killed it. The Mahusaurus is gone. Kentrosaurus getting a kill. Boah, right in the face. Wow, impressive. Ooh, lady, hello, hello. We got a fight between Stegojira and Megas Ma Megalosaurus. And well, oh, oh yeah, definitely. I think we all know who's gonna win this one. The Stegojira on 100% outlasting the Mega Faganax, I should point out. And no surprise here, Megalosaurus is dead. Ooh, the buck. Oh, no, Stegojira doesn't have a kill animation, apparently. Apparently, I didn't give it one. Torvosaurus here having some fun with the vehicles. But wow, Triceratops MVP. Okay, Stegosaurus is still alive. Torvosaurus is still alive. Okay, Stegojira looks to be in the best possible state. The T-Rex is still alive. Got quite a few herbivores as well. Uh, let's not forget that the Stegosaur that the sauropods can't actually fight because reasons. And actually, yeah, I think Gojirasaurus is the only little one left, so. Well done to Gojirasaurus, they're apparently won, and it killed the Deinonychus, so yeah, well played Gojirasaurus, Gojirasaurus winning the mini cup. Of course, it wasn't much of a mini cup, because half the things in it get hunted down. Ooh, here we go, a fight between the Kralophosaurus and Torvosaurus. Kralophosaurus on, on a 77, 54%, looking pretty good, but it's still ha but the Torvosaurus does get off two hits, so the Cryo should be due for one. Yum. Oh wait, I think the Cryo might actually win this. Ooh, Magma Blaster versus Blizzard Smash. Ooh, doesn't get any more intense than that. But, will we get a killer blow between these two? Oh, I think we are. Yeah, the Torvosaurus biting the big one. The Cryolophosaurus has basically done naff all in this whole match. But it does kill the Torvosaurus, proving that Magma Blaster is no match for the Blizzard Smash. Hasn't really done much in this battle royal, has it? It's kind of been disappointed, but you know, good to see it get at least one kill before it probably dies. Oh no, the Polar Canvas did not survive its rematch with the T-Rex. Ooh, ooh, hang on, are we going to see these two square off? Stegojira taking on the Cycenia, I think we are. Ooh, this could be costly for the Stegojira. Actually, you have pretty good stats. 100, 130. 
So it's 130 to 110. So Stego Jura should win this. But the Cychenia, I think, will get off a hit. Or maybe not. Oh, it does get off a hit. Go on, Cychenia. Hit him again. Prove that you can beat this thing. Oh, it does get off another hit. Stegojira does take a beat in here. Stegojira land the killing blow, or can the Cychenia hold on? No, the Cychenia's gone. Didn't quite happen for it, didn't really do much, and again, the Stegojira has no killing animation, they just flop over and die. Okay, so yeah, who do we have left? Okay, the Crowlophosaurus we have left, looking pretty, pretty decent. The T-Rex looking really good. The Kentrosaurus, which got a kill. The Stegosaurus, where's our MVP? There's the MVP, the Triceratops. Like, I can't believe this thing got three kills. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Look at Joe Borrio and Epistacilla Cordia just enjoying life. They're like, yes, we're invincibles. No one can kill us. Ah, oh, this Stegosaurus having a snooze. We haven't actually seen too much of Stegosaurus. It's, it's been like the Crowlophosaurus. It's just disappeared. <laughs> And then all of a sudden you just see it again. Ooh, ooh, hang on. The Crowlophosaurus picking a fight with a Kentrosaurus. And the Crowlophosaurus hasn't fully healed, so Kentrosaurus might have a chance here. Although I do think the Cryo is quite powerful, so I do think... Wow. Oh, oh, wow. Will Kentrosaurus get a hit? It does get a hit. So the Crowlophosaurus does take a hit, but I think it's going to be a bit too powerful for the Kentrosaurus. No, 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 re really? Oh, I tell you what. Friggin' a piss to see the Cordia. Out of the way. I tell you what. The Kendrosaurus holding its own there. The Crowlophosaurus not in the best of shapes there. And it might get picked off by something. Ooh, could Triceratops pick it off? I would have to say all the carnivores are dead. I think pretty much all the big carnivores are dead. Because they, they all fought each other. You know, the Eocarcaria, the Spino, they all, the Mapu, the Kark, they're all gone. Like, we got Stegojura and T-Rex, and I think that's it, other than Cryo. Yeah, we got Stego, T-Rex, and the Cryo, and that's basically it, out of all the carnivore. Which means they... Wait, what? Oh no, the Cryo, wait, what? Oh my god, it's dying? Wait, can it not drink? Because it says it's thirsty. I might have to have a word with Dino Nerd there. It, I, I don't know if it can drink. Mm. Okay, we'll be we'll be fair. We'll heal it up a little bit. Not too much. I know, I know, I know, I know. You shouldn't interfere, but we'll heal it up a tad. Because if it if it can't, oh, hang on, never mind. The cryo has to wait because we've got a fight between the Stegojira and the T-Rex. Well, if the, if the cryo dies at first, then it's just these two left to take on all the herbivores, so I think we might have a herb. I think Triceratops is going to win! <laughs> I think the Trite's actually going to win. Because these two are going to be weakened when they take it on, and the Triceratops is on 100%. Okay, will the T-Rex finish it off? I mean, it should. Look at the size of his skull. It could just rip this thing a new one. But Stegojira is not one to back down. Yep, Stegojira's gone. No match for the biting power of the T-Rex. Wow, Stegojira out. So yeah, we only have T-Rex left. Which is bad for the T-Rex because it's, it did take a hit. And it has to take on Stegosaurus. Kentrosaurus and the OP Triceratops. Okay, yeah, I am going to heal the Crown. So yeah, the, the Crown of the Sword is not in a good shape to fight at all. And well, apparently it's thirsty. But I, I don't know why it won't drink. Okay, since we got less combatants and they all seem to be over here, we are going to enclose them in a bit. Oh, well, well, it doesn't matter because <laughs> nothing can kill the Apathosaurus anyway. Okay, yes, we've shut off the arena a bit, so we got... Oh, 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 oh no. <laughs> well, I think this is the end of the Cryolophosaurus. It's not going to survive this rematch with the Kentrosaurus. It took an absolute beating from the Kentrosaurus before and is probably not going to survive this one. Go on, Kentrosaurus, get it over with. Boosh! Yeah, no surprise here. Cryo's dead. <laughs> I I think we're gonna I'm gonna have to have a wheel with Dino Nerd, because it's it's dehydrated and I don't know why it won't drink. I don't know if it'll drink. I'll tell you what we'll do, just just in an experiment, I'll release another one in here. You know, it's not gonna fight anything, because there's nothing here to fight. And we'll see if it takes a drink. Because I actually think the cryo was dying because it couldn't drink. And I think it's unable to drink. 
tell you what, we'll have one last look at it before before the um, final battle begins. God, don't I look awesome? I didn't get a kill, so we saw what it can do. We saw we saw it win a battle, so I'm not going to complain too much. I didn't expect it to be down to this lot, so we have the T-Rex on 77%. And it has to take on Degasaurus, Kentrosaurus, and Triceratops. Like, I, I gotta say, the team, I think this is gonna be a win for the hip. Ooh. Is it taking on the Triceratops? Oh my, if Triceratops wins, this is insane. Oh my god, come on, that's unfair. Boosh, god, Triceratops, you've come all this way. Don't die to a T Rex. You killed three carnivores, you can do it! There's only a T-Rex, you've killed plenty of them. Just be inspired by how many times Chomp killed Terry in the anime. God, Triceratops! We're all rooting for you, buddy! We're all rooting for you! Oh, he made him back down! The T-Rex is forced to back down. Although, the downside for the trike is that the T-Rex does have better heal rate than the Triceratops, so... Even though the T-Rex lost, it will heal quicker than the Triceratops, so... Not out of the woods yet, but the T-Rex is weakened, which means if any one of these two can kill the T-Rex, then the Triceratops will win. If the T-Rex dies, then I'm going to declare Triceratops the winner, because the Stegosaurus doesn't have a kill, and the Kentrosaurus... Actually, hang on a minute, Kentrosaurus might win. I just thought of that. Yeah, I just thought of that. He's got two kills as well. Well, if the Kentrosaurus kills T-Rex, then we're going to say it's a, a two-way tie between Triceratops and Kentrosaurus. Y you don't need to fight him, buddy. You've already won. Triceratops. Oh, hang on. Oh, this, this Triceratops. <laughs> Triceratops is like turning his back on it. like, no, I don't want to fight you yet. You must get to my left. I'm 61% each. 62, 61. The Triceratops does just edge you out in HP, but I don't know if that's going to matter because the T-Rex is much more powerful. And um, T-Rex will get a first hit, 100%. Oh god, Triceratops deserves to win. It really does. It killed three things. It's amazing. God, Triceratops. Oh, it gets the first hit. God, Triceratops. You can do it. You can do it. He got the first hit. Oh, are you serious? They killed it in one hit! Well, um... Oh no! <laughs> the Triceratops died! Are you serious, sir? I can't believe it died in one hit! How many duck kills have you actually got? Five. Are you serious? It had 60% health and it died instantly to the T-Rex! Although the T-Rex did take a beating, so it can still die. It's still anyone's game. And the T-Rex has to take on the Stegosaurus and it has to take on the Kentrosaurus. And it's weakened, so... Well, it, it doesn't matter now. It's, it's a Kentrosaurus is either going to win or, or the T-Rex is going to win. The Stegosaurus will not win because, well, it hasn't done anything. Even if it kills the T-Rex, it'll only have one kill. Whereas the Kentrosaurus already has two kills. It killed the Cryo and the Macrosaurus. T-Rex, a 68% T-Rex taking on a 100% Stegosaurus. And oh, wow, T-Rex gets the first hit. Impressive, but God, Stegosaurus gotta get a hit. God, Steg, finish him off. It all comes down to this, if the Stegosaurus can kill the T-Rex, which it won't because the T-Rex is backing down. But yeah, T-Rex is taking a beating. Yeah, Kentrosaurus has won. I think Kentrosaurus has won. <laughs> Somehow, a Kentrosaurus has won. Like, the T-Rex is at 8 20%. Wait, is he gonna... I thought he was gonna take it on, then. You know, Stegosaurus took a hit, but the T-Rex took an even bigger one. Look at these two having fun with vehicles here. Oh, oh, the crown's tail glitched out there. Okay, I'm pretty convinced that this Crowlophosaurus, for whatever reason, just cannot eat and it cannot drink. And that is probably why it died so easily in the battle in the battle royale. So I think it, I think it was quite I think it was fair for me to put in put in another one because the fit oh look at that <laughs> these two just want to destroy cars. Cryo hates global warming. He wants things on the cool side. 
Yeah, I think it was a bit unfit. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, I think this is it. Yeah, this has to be it. This has to be it for the T-Rex. I think against all the odds, Kentrosaurus has somehow won. Ooh, will the T-Rex kill the steg, though? If it kills the steg, that could change everything. Because the T-Rex hasn't been hit yet. If it can kill it without taking a hit. That, I think, puts T-Rex in the driving seat. Nope, it's taking a hit. Yes! The Kentrosaurus has done it! Oh, right in the face. The Stegosaurus, who has basically done nothing this whole battle of Royale, has taken out the T-Rex. You should be proud of yourself, buddy. I mean, it doesn't mean you've won, because Kentrosaurus, amazingly, has killed two dinosaurs and is the winner. Like, that is incredible. The Stegosaurus teaming up to take down the T-Rex. The T-Rex will get a respectable third place. But, oh my god, that was awesome. So, yeah, that's basically it. The sauropods, well, they were just loafing around. They were never going to win. Because nothing can kill them. They're basically invincible. The Kendrosaurus is just amazing. It's, it deserves to, it. Deserved it. It deserved it. It killed the Mapusaurus, I think. And it did finish off a weakened Cryo, which was kind of a cheap kill, to be honest. Because the Cryo was already starving to death. Kendrosaurus deserved it, even if it did get a cheap kill against the Cryo. But Stegosaurus, a definite runner-up, and wow. Who would have guessed that two herbivores, not just two herbivores, two Stegosaurs would have finished in the top two? The Kentrosaurus, who deserved to win, and the Stegosaurus, who basically done naff all until it killed the T-Rex. And the T-Rex will get third place, and ooh. Okay, we'll watch this fight. Can our champ take down the Kralophosaurus? We're on 100%, so I think the Kralophosaurus is actually going to win. Getting revenge for its dead brother, I suspect. Oh, I'll tell you what, though. Kentrosaurus gets a hit. I mean, this doesn't matter. This is irrelevant, because Kentrosaurus has already won. So, yeah, th that is our top three. Kentrosaurus first, Stegosaurus second, and the T-Rex third. And the Kralophosaurus getting some sweet revenge on the Kentrosaurus for killing its brother. And that, my friends, is an excellent way to end this session. So I hope you enjoyed. Oh, that was an epic battle of Re Royale. Oh yeah, shout out to the Gojurasaurus as well for winning the mini cut. And if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. And subscribe for more Dinosaur King mod showcases in the coming weeks. And until then, this is Stranger Gamer, signing out.